uh, to create a BioLink page on Kartra. Today, we're going to talk about how we can create a BioLink page just like Linktree on Kartra so that we can have a uh, BioLink page on our own domain. And I will walk you through the steps now. Hey, I'm Karma. I help coaches, freelancers, and online entrepreneurs get clients consistently without social media burnout so that they can scale with evergreen systems and strategies. I post weekly videos about online marketing, coaching, and entrepreneurship. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to receive the latest updates on my videos. And don't forget to check out the description in my videos to get the free trainings and courses. So before further ado, we are gonna go to Kartra and we're gonna open a new page. Once you start a new page, you're gonna click on sections and you're gonna go ahead and drag an empty block. It's gonna ask us to add a column. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to components and columns and we're gonna select a 50% single column. We're gonna drag one and then we're gonna drag one more here. And I'll show you why. So we have two columns right now, right? And the first column, we're gonna drag a component of an image. All right. So with, for this image, what I'm gonna put is here on um, Canva. So just to get this look, let's say here, look like a link tree kind of bio link look. I created um, the heading for it, right? It's almost, think about this um, divided to two pieces, right? The image, uh, the photo piece right here. And I did this one uh, 1500 by 1500 size. So after that one, I created a, from this one, I created just the background here. Let me make this a little smaller for you so you have the idea. Okay. So this is just the background, basically, right? And once I put this on top of this, and then you're gonna, I'm gonna add the buttons. So here. Okay. So once I added these components, um, let me go back to the component tab. That's where I switch. So here I'm going to go ahead and change the picture. I'm going to select it, the picture I downloaded from Canva as the top part of my um, BioLink page. Change the alt tag. Go ahead and add button component and the second column. Now, here, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go ahead and edit this one and then clone a bunch of buttons from this so I don't have to edit each button. So I'm gonna select the uh, full size button. I'm gonna change this button color to, uh, where's my button color right here? Change it to a light green and then I'm gonna center it, right? So I'm gonna say apply. So I'm gonna clone a button for each link. Five is enough right now for the sake of this video. And I am going to now go back to columns tab here up top. And I'm gonna click on this purple part to edit the column itself, right? So to edit the column, I clicked on that button and I'm going to click on the image or the column and select my image as the image I, um, it's the same image I, the other image I <laughs> uploaded from Canva. Here we go. Now it gave us a background, right? Now what you can do, 
component. I can add another component of a headline. Um, this is pretty simple, so I can select here. And um, let's go back to components tab. This is something I keep missing a lot. So you guys, if you can't do something, go up and, and check if you're in the right tab, if you're in the right tab to edit the components or columns. Anyway, now it's gonna give me access. I'm gonna just delete this part. And I'm probably gonna make this smaller. But let's say a call to action. Check out my free courses and resources. I don't know, I may wanna change this font action to, this up is something I need. Okay, so we gave a call to action. You can do better, obviously, with the design. <laughs> uh, but it's just to give you a, an idea. So here, text goes here. What I'm going to do, I am going to go ahead and click on each button. Um, text. So this one, let's say, free course. Okay. And then I am going to go to the link and I'm going to link this to another page. My uh, free course opt-in page is also on Kartra. So I'm going to say another Kartra page. And I am going to find the page I want to attach. Um, opt-in page, copy kit, LP. okay. And I usually want to open it in a new tab. That's how I like it as a user. And that's what I do. You don't have to do this. And I'm going to say apply. So now this is a clickable button. Okay. And here, let's say, I'm going to say join my Facebook group. And I'm going to click on the link, link to another page. It is going to be an external page. So I'm going to put my link here, my Facebook group link, workshop. Okay. Open a new tab because I like it that way. And it's optional. You don't have to. And so on and on. So you're going to change these links. Of course, if you want, you can put your head, like the header for your website and footer. But if you just want it to, you know, look like just like a link tree type of page, then you can, let's preview this. Then you can use this. Basically, you're just going to um, um, publish it live. So open preview. So when we look at the preview, this is how we see it. So you can put this link the URL to this page, to your Instagram bio or your Facebook bio, any, any social media platforms. And um, it's going to bring traffic to your own domain instead of going to Linktree. And it's going to give a look of, you know, Linktree with all your links on it that they can click on. So I hope this was helpful. Let me know what helped you about this and let me know if you have any, com um, any questions or comments. Um, I'll see you next time.